This is awesome. Welcome back to this play by email versus Joachim Haydn. Today we're going to be going over our turn setup and strategy on December 9th, 1941. This is our third turn. Uh, we'll go ahead and go over starting off in Marshall Islands as usual. Still retreating for most of our uh, forces just in case he does send the carriers in. We've got no sign of them yet, so I think he might not. Um, so we're going to go ahead and send this task force back to Creek Island so we can pick up the clods. And we'll transfer those to truck because I'm sending down an air division. I'm hoping with air field five in an air division, or it's a uh, range five. I think it's an air division. But uh, we're hoping between those two that I can go ahead and upgrade those to zeros. Not to mention I got uh, Kitty Batai is uh, heading south away from uh, the Philippines towards truck. Um, that way we can support. The invasion of Rabal and these guys down here. Um, Ryu, Joe, and Tayo are heading north to Cal. They're going to meet up with uh, um, Kaga and that. They'll resize everything and then we'll go from there. Um, I flew off the claws off Battle Bob to um, Tayo uh, so they can also upgrade two zeros into Cal. Uh, meanwhile, we are waiting on. And these transports should get there next turn. We should be able to load up the 144th Infantry Division. So next stop will be Anbon. Um, these guys are going to be heading back to Battle Bob. They're going to start covering our invasion of Celebs. Uh, we'll start off. We'll land a force here at Sedate. Then we'll land a force at Minato and turn eight. Uh, I think we'll probably just do these first so I can cover them with air cover from Battle Bob. Uh, we'll land here, take this base, land here. Once this base gets taken, then we'll take Monado. That means they won't retreat. We don't have to hunt them down. Then we'll use a airfield unit. We'll have it Monado. We'll use that to cover uh, any further invasions of Ternate, Kandari from uh, bombers. Uh, well, obviously, we'll have plenty of uh, combat power to cover them. All right, over here, uh, Kaga and that is already heading for Takao. Once they get there, they'll resize, upgrade anything they need to do. Uh, we pulled all the rest of our landing forces out of Mersing, so he can't ambush us with uh, subs. Um, we're heading east to cut off anything heading south. We're heading south to uh, Johor Bahru. We do have, we're showing movement north out of Singapore. So I don't know if he's trying to just go ahead and give up on Singapore because of the Mersing Gambit and try to get him out to maybe Tamula. So uh, next turn, we're going to be bombing Singapore Airport, Johor Bahru Airport. Uh, and then the turn after that, we'll start bombing basically Tamula, Johor, and Singapore Airport all three days so he can't build forts. Uh, it does look like he's pulling forces out up here. I'm not sure why these guys are heading north to Georgetown if he's pulling them out. So I'm not sure what his plan is. But we had the forces from Kwantan chasing. We had the forces from Qu uh, Brew chasing. Um, I believe the Imperial Division, the Guards Division, should be transferring to Singura next turn. And they'll start heading south. Uh, that's the plan for right now. Um, we'll see if we get any more naval strikes next turn on any of these guys in the south. We split this surface group into two groups. We got one covering trying to ambush these, and we have one trying to come up and ambush these guys for the rest of the guys from Singapore. Um, we took San Fernando. Those guys are heading south. Um, we will be starting our uh, bombing of uh, Parkfield. Baton in Manila to keep him from building forts next turn. Uh, we're waiting on the 104th Division, which is two days out before our first attack on Hong Kong. And other than that, we're just trying to slow down and do as much damage. I ordered a shock, talk, shock attack here in this clear terrain to see if we can destroy this Chinese core before we can get it. Uh, other than that, I think that's it. It looks like, yes, in China. Um, nothing new in Burma. And then we're just waiting for a lot of these guys to uh, transfer over. Uh, we have first of second div unloading. And then we have this airfield unit starting to head for Marcus Island to help with our detection. We will be sending an airfield unit to uh, Paramount Shigiso, which I don't know if I sent them out already or not. But we will be sending an airfield unit here, and then we will be trying to get a unit for ADAC and Amchika and take this as well. That'll cover our 
advance to on um, Japan from any of his carriers. Um, all in all, that's pretty much it. We're just upgrading our fighters as we can get. Uh, our aircraft replacements still kind of low here. Let's see here. We got plenty of nails and plenty of zeros. Though those zeros can go up really fast. Like if we just expand one of our squadrons to max, that's going to take our entire zero pool. Uh, but we're up, upping this uh, production as much as we can. And I think, yeah. So we need Oscar 1C production to produce up. So hopefully these get produced quite a bit. And then we can start uh, upgrading our nates to 1Cs. And that's, you know, just two days in the game. It's going to take a while for us to get that production up. So that should be our plan for the next turn. So hopefully this goes well. We should have the... Uh, this should be going out on Saturday. Uh, we should have the turn, I think, Saturday. So I should be able to have another video coming out tomorrow, uh, which is Sunday with the next, uh, with this combat replay. So I'll catch you guys later.